Hello everybody, it is Sydney here again with a little bit different um, video. If you are new here, my name is Sydney. I am also known as Shoot by the Truckload on Poshmark, eBay, Macari, all of those fun sites because I am a full-time reseller. Um, today, I have a jean thread up box that I just ordered. It got here a couple days ago. Um, I did open it as you can see, um, but I like really quickly went through it um, before we had to leave for a party on Halloween. Um, so I just wanted to go through it all. It actually is pretty good. Um, again, a little bit more detail than what I did, you know, in five seconds the other day. Um, so we will get into it. I'm gonna grab this receipt here. So, it's a rescue box DIY denim, 50 pounds. Um, and I am in my kitchen because the box is really heavy and I didn't want to carry it upstairs. So we're just chilling here today. Um, and I paid $60. I feel like I had to pay shipping. So I don't know how much shipping was. Um, I think I tried to use like a free shipping code, but it told me I couldn't on like a rescue item, but I did have credit. So I just like used that credit and pay anything out of pocket. Okay, so I'll try to just like kind of go back and forth-ish here. So this first um, pair up here is um, the Liz Lange Maternity for Target. And these are a size small and they are just some shorts. Um, this was in my redonate pile, but I may try to just sell them. They're kind of like pilly right here. Uh, nah, I don't think it's like worth my time. So those will go bye-bye. Um, these are original quality for Aeropostale. I don't know why I said that whole thing. They're Aeropostale. Um, those are like the tiniest little shorts ever. Let's see what size are. They're three, four. I don't really think this style of shorts like quite in. It's also the wrong season. I think more of like the high rise shorts are in and like more distressing. So those will go bye-bye. Um, these are Liverpool, which if I remember correctly is pretty good. Um, they are a size 12. Uh, doesn't look like there's any puckering. There is wear here in between the thighs. Um, I'm going to try to pill shape that and just see if it helps it. If not, I'll just disclose it because I, like I said, I think these are a good brand. If they're not a good brand, then I'm not even going to mess with it. Um, American Eagle, the favorite boyfriend, size six. These will do pretty good, I think. They kind of look funny to me, but maybe they're short. Oh, there's paint on the back of them. So those will be going bye-bye. Um, Denim Co. I say made in Pakistan. Never heard of this brand. I mean, it doesn't feel the greatest, but I can definitely look it up. I mean, it has like that raw hem and then distressing. I think they're too distressed though. Like somebody, like there was holes in them and then somebody like put their foot through it like I do. Oh yeah, I see it's like all the way down there. So those will go away. Another pair of shorty shorts, which are O'Neal size five. Um, yeah, kind of the same thing. I mean, O'Neill isn't super cheap. I mean, those were probably like 40 to $50, but I don't know. Not really worth it to me right now. Um, these are Aeropostale. And these have a lot of puckering to them. So we don't want those. Another pair of shorts. These are um, H&M. So, yeah, I want those. More shorts. These are so, so that's um, cold. Um, so these are seven for all my kind, the Kimmy boot cut. Um, this wouldn't be something that I picked up like at the thrift or anything, but I do work with a local consignment store and she loves getting jeans, like she just sells them super fast. So I'm gonna bring those over to her. Um, same thing with these ones. These are Rock Revival size 28. 
I just don't have the best of luck selling jeans. I don't know why. Maybe my pictures are bad. I don't know. But she'll just do it for me in a minute. So yeah, those are cute. Little shirt. Um, these are uh, Kohl's. So um, I feel like the this isn't cropped. I don't think so. Um, these are the Dinsen for Levi's, which I feel like is um, Kohl's, but I don't know. These are the Jogger. They're really soft. Um, let's see I don't have an answer, but I will bring these to the consignment store. Somebody wants to be comfy. Um, wallflower. This was one I didn't know. Um, they don't feel like good quality, but I want to look them up just to, you know, educate myself. They are like a boot cut. They have that thick stitching on them. I'm going to look them up just to, again, um, educate myself on it. These are mud, which is Kohl's. Again, super cheap brand. No, thank you. Um, Aria jeans. Uh, they're like a Bermuda thing. We don't want those. Style & Co. I don't remember what where those are sold. Probably like Kohl's or JCPenney's or something like that. And they're a size 16 short. But there's a lot of puckering on them. I would probably try to sell them because they're plus size, but those are kind of like, there's like no shape to them. I was pumped about these. The cute little Carhartt overalls. They're size four. So my niece and nephew will like those and then they will be given back to me. There's, this is that Dinzen for Levi's again. I'm probably saying that's so wrong. Um, they're just a modern skinny, so I'm just going to bring these over to the um, consignment shop. They're just a nice, like, dark wash skinny jean, so. Um, these are Torrid. I am going to sell these just because they are that plus size. Um, what the heck, man? Oh, 18 tall, which is also great. They have a little bit of, like, distressing on them in my book. Um, can can. I was going to bring these to the consignment shop, but there's a lot of puckering on them. They're super stressed out. There's even, or stretched out, there's even puckering on the butt. So somebody was trying real hard to get into these, which I can relate, but we don't want that. Um, these are just coals again. Um, again, just like puckering everywhere. D jeans. I don't know. Maybe I need to look these up just to, um, again, give myself some more knowledge. I mean, they do not feel very good at all. So, we don't need those. Um, two Super Low by Levi's 524s, size 3 medium. I don't really know what that means. But also, I need to do some research because there's another pair in here like this. The little red tab doesn't say Levi's on it. It says it obviously up here, but that doesn't say it. So I don't know what that means. Um, again, just giving myself some more knowledge. Also, I don't know if they're real. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. So we gotta figure that out. These have like a weird puckering right there on the thigh. I don't know. I was gonna bring them to the consignment shop. I'll just ask her if she wants them. I mean, again, I'm gonna do that research, but then we'll just see what she says. Um, these are City Skinny DKNY. Um, just another pair I'm just gonna bring to the consignment shop. They probably won't sell for much, but that's okay. And they're not puckered. Another pair of those D jeans. It's literally the same exact pair. Um, no boundaries, which is Walmart, but they are lots of puckering on them, so we don't want them. These are Jessica Simpson Forever Roll Skinny, but they're like this neon green. I don't really think this is in style anymore. 
so we don't want them. These are blank NYC, which I was pretty jacked about, but I don't know how well their jeans do. So this is what they look like. They're a good like medium wash with some like stuff right there. They're a size 27. But yeah, we're just gonna go with it. And I mean, if they don't sell very well, I can look, I'm gonna look them up on Poshmark and if they don't do very well, I'll bring them to the good side of my shop. Easy enough. Um, this is a brand I didn't know. So I'm gonna look them up, Kennedy MFG Company. They feel really nice. So I don't, again, I don't know. And they're a size 38, so they are a nice size. Um, yeah, we're gonna look them up. Um, Current Elliott, which I was pleased about as well. Um, they're size 28. There's like a spot right here. You might not be able to see it, but I think I can get that out. Um, they're like a raw hem, but a flare. Let's see, is there a style? There's not. I don't know, they look nice though. They're very high rise. We'll see. Um, these are super old Lucky Brand. I was going to bring them to the consignment shop, but they like whitewash. Again, this is like a super old tag. I don't, I think we're just gonna pass on these bad boys. Um, these are free people. They need a fixing, but I can do that. Free people, size 26. Um, one of the belt loops came off. Usually when that happens, it will make a hole in it, but it didn't. So I can easily just tack that bad boy back on and call it a day. They're really cute and like a little bit distressed, gray. Day trip. Um, I don't know this brand, but it is very cheaply made and there's lots of puckering, so we don't need that. Um, Lane Bryant Capri. So this is another one I was going to sell, but I just don't think people are really into Capris anymore. Um, it's just like, I don't know. We're just gonna not make it worth our time. Uh, this was another one I was gonna sell. They're the Levi's 712 Slim, but they are puckering pretty bad in the front there. So nobody wants those. Um, some American Eagle Distress Shorts. So this is, I feel like this is more like the style that people want to wear right now. Like the Distress High Rise, not like so much of like a tiny little booty short. These are, I don't usually tells you. They must just be a little bit, but that's fine. And they're size 12, so I don't know. That's more of something I feel like is the style now. Um, these are just old navy rock star jeans, but they are really cute and distressed. So I'll sell these. They won't. Actually, I'll bring these to the consignment shop. But if you've never tried old navy rock star jeans, you should because I love them too. Um, these are maternity. They're just old navy rock stars, um, but they are my size. So I think I'm just going to hoard them away. Cute and distressed maternity. We're just gonna hoard these bad boys away. Um, these are loft, and again, this was another pair I was just gonna take into consignment, but they are puckered like nobody's business. Um, cover girl. I don't know, this is sold probably like Kmart, but again, they are super cheaply made, like they're so thin. So we don't need those. Um, Bullhead, which is um, Paxson. Again, would take them to a consignment shop, but somebody puckered the heck out of them. So, um, this like skirt, it's a size 8. I don't know, I feel like it's kind of dated. It's Karen Scott, which is not really the greatest brand ever, but sometimes it does okay ish but i just felt like the style was dated so i don't think we need them um these are citizens of humanity they're the kelly 
number 001 stretch low waist boot cut. Such a long title. Uh, but these will go to the consignment shop as well. Super easy. What size they are? 28. So it's also a good size. Um, some nice American Eagles. Just looking for puckering. I think they're good though. Let's see. These ones. These are the Tom Girls, so it's a good style. They're a size 4. Probably consignment shop. The less I have to do, the better it makes me feel ish um these are that uh, that brand and brand the amethyst i think i had before maybe it was different we don't need those um these are it, the tag is ripped out but you can tell by that purple tag it's like gloria vanderbilt or something like that that you see 8.5 million pairs at the thrift store um i think it's kohl's but we do not want those these are St. John's Bay, which is sold at JCPenney's, I believe. Um, they are my keep side, so maybe I was thinking because they are plus size, I would just put them on for like 20 bucks or something. Um, yeah, they're 22W, so yeah, I think that's a good idea. Just put them on for like $20. Um, these are BDG, which is Nordstrom. Or not too much, I can't remember, but they're like a super high rise skinny jeans with the distressed knees. Um, I will probably just take these to consignment. I don't know why that took me so long. 27W, that does not make any sense, but 27W twig high rise. They're cute though. <coughs> oh, yeah, I was jacked about these too. Um, Everlane, I've never found these before. They're actually in really good condition. Um, the only thing I can think of, there's like a little bit of a spot right here. I don't know if you can see it. I can get that out. The only other thing I can think of that they didn't take them is because there's like some color transfer on that leather patch, but I'm okay with that. I'll list these. Um, I did not know what size they are. Oh, it's right here. 28 regular. And they are the, I don't know what they are. That's okay. I will totally list them. They're very high rise. I like them. Another pair of shorts. These are, oh, I didn't know what brand this was. So I just wanted to look them up just to make sure. They feel pretty cheap, but I don't know. Indigo Rain, just like a distressed short. Again, they may not be worth anything. So I may toss or send them off to be donated. But um, I just wanted to make sure I knew what they were. And then... These were really cute, and I don't know this brand either, so I gotta do some more research. Um, but they are really cute jeans, so I'm all about it. So they are Sandpiper, size 22, and they're just this really cute embroidered, like flower embroidered skinny or straight. So, and they don't feel cheap, so we'll we'll find out. And the last pair. Um, this is that other pair of Levi's that doesn't say Levi's on the tab there, but it's, and that's kind of distressed. I don't know. Again, I got to do some more research because I don't know if they even make fake Levi's. So we'll just go with that and do some research about it. Alrighty, that was it. That's a pretty big keep pile, so I feel like that's a good sign. Obviously, there was a lot that... I can't do anything about, but that's okay. That's what these boxes are for. Um, but if you enjoyed that, hit the thumbs up button and subscribe and we will see you later.